I am going to make Anna a golden egg. you might ask? Yes, I am asking. <laughs> it is a fan of Golden Child. <laughs> and so we're going to embark on a new series that goes through how Golden Child and how to love them so that Anna also loves them because I love them. So there's a story where this all begins. So this all begins in Korea when I was there in January. Once upon a time. <laughs> Once upon a time. <laughs> um, and I was given a really cool opportunity to go to a Music Bank live recording because my professor had a connection that was a producer of Music Bank. And so we got these tickets. Because we got the tickets from a producer, we were like down in the front with the special section instead of with each of the individual fan clubs. And because the studio is a lot smaller than it looks on TV, we were like right next to the MCs. And one of the MCs is Golden Child's Tableman. Tableman might be tall. I've heard people call him good looking. He's a baby, so I can't say that. <laughs> But like I just said, he is a baby. And so when we first saw him, he like walked out and I think he was kind of shocked to see three like very clearly foreigners sitting in the second row with like all of the producer's friends. Mm -hmm. And so he was kind of like, what? And the whole time during the thing, he was kind of like, what? <laughs> and because of this, he was so cute and he's like a little bit like awkward baby. Mm -hmm. So we adopted him. And so now Tableman is my son. He doesn't know that, <laughs> I know that. <laughs> and but because of that now. And because of that now, I have gotten back into Golden Child, mm -hmm. and I think Anna also needs to be into Golden Child. We'll see. I don't know a lot about Golden Child, so my background is I listened to their debut song when it first came out, and mm -hmm. I can easily point out who Taeyeol is, and that's about Why it. Why is that, Anna? <laughs> because I used to be a really big In Spirit. I was a really big Infinite fan. They were my first K-pop concert that I ever went to. Oh. It was a great time. Back when I was very young. <laughs> very long time ago. Very long time ago. She's old now. <laughs> I'm older, so I can't even say that. <laughs> but yeah, that's about all I know from Golden Child. Mm. I like their debut song is always stuck in my head and I know that they wear like baseball outfits, but in their debut like, song. Yeah. yeah. I can't even recognize Pullman yet, which Peyton is very upset about. <laughs> it's fine, but... he's only my child. Anyways. So this is gonna be a journey. Yeah. Peyton well, is like trying to get me into them, but it hasn't been effective. Like, like she hasn't done a lot yet, but I basically just me. kind of yelled at her that I adopted this child. <laughs> so I'm going in blind, really. Yeah. So today we're gonna start with an unhelpful guide reaction, so yes. that when we actually watch their music videos and or live stages, Anna can kind of recognize their faces, um, rather than me just like screaming every time. <laughs> it's him! It's him! It's him! It's him! Um, so yeah, we're so we're gonna start with that. We're also gonna eat. Cause we're hungry and yeah, it's late. late. <laughs> so let's go. Oh, link to the unhelpful guide yeah. that we use will be in the description below. Thank you for providing this video, XLL videos. Yeah. We will link it down below for anyone who wants to watch it. Highly Every recommend. There go. I'm hungry. Yay. Welcome to my guide to Golden Child. They are the cutest and fluffiest group I've ever seen. I hope you'll love them as much as I do. Well, okay. they're fluffy. Oh. I'm trying to pay attention. So, oh. they debuted with 11 members. Jaysok did leave for health reasons in 2018. Goldness and coolness? Uh, uh I know Koita. Mm. A bowling pin? Mm hmm. Excuse me, why? I don't know. There was a reality show? Sorry. Hmm? Hmm? There you are! Hey! Mm. They look so similar. Yeah, I know he's a vocalist. I'll watch it later, right? Mm. Where is Hayo? Oh, yeah. Where are you? I don't see him. Oh. Right there. <laughs> oh. <laughs> well, it's a different song. He's also one of the dancers. Oh, he has this. He's mm. dyslexic? Mm hmm. I didn't know Every that. Okay. Jersey number. Yes. They chose it for their debut because it was a baseball concept. Mm. Mm. I think they actually chose it in Olympic right before their debut, but mm. I'm not sure about it. 
Wait, two things about that really quick. So yeah, he has dyslexia. Mm. And he and some girl both have it and they're very outspoken about it. Mm. Like helping people with it. Also, when they say bad humor, mm. it's like dad humor. Oh. Like he's literally like the dad. Guy. Yeah. Mm. Like he's literally like their dad because he's also so much older than some of them. Yeah. And he raised them. So moving mm. on. Ayo. Right? That's Ayo. Mm. <laughs> he's also good at girl group dancing. Mm. Why? Che. Mm. Huh? Mm. Is he one of their main vocalists? Mm. He's one of their female mm. vocalists. He's the one where I said that he reminds me more of Song Yu and the other one reminds me more of Hu Young. Like their vocal quality. So he's Song Yu. Yeah. I'm not very Song Yu. Yeah, yeah. The unmasking on Mask Singer was so good. He's the yellow one? He's the one in the middle. Yeah. Yeah. Or, oh, there's the another yellow, yellow one. Yeah. He's a bunny. Wait, can we pause for a second? Yeah. Why is it number three? Oh, so he said he wanted to be, I don't know all the reasons for all their jerseys, but I know why. Mm -hmm. um, because he wants Golden Child to always be in the top three of everything they do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, isn't that cute? That's like more realistic than number one. Yeah. Which is good. Set realistic goals. We stand an intellectual. Yeah. Big brain. My friend, my chingu. Changjun. This is a funny dude, right? Chang yeah. <laughs> you are probably gonna recognize him the most quickly <laughs> because he's the funny one. I've sent her videos of him. <laughs> also, okay. She sent me a video of, she was like, I know you aren't really a golden child fan yet, but watch this video. <laughs> I just started like, at so this hard. second, starting at this minute, the second mark, and it was him falling in water. I just We're related so hard, and then the editors did him so dirty. Mm. The way he like runs. Also, I was watching a video of um, like I think it was Lunar New Year, like yeah. idol athletic Olympic thing that they yeah, do, yeah. and it was Golden Child versus ATs. Mm. And since I think it was him that lost that round, mm. and I was reading the comments. This is like recent. I was reading the comments, and they were like. He loses and immediately like starts acting funny, and then I think they said Pullman is the one who runs over and just starts taking pictures. Yeah, but I thought that was funny. He and Pullman have a really cute relationship. Really? Yeah. Oh, okay. Also, he's the one at the very beginning of Pam Daddy that's like, oh, it's you know. I don't remember that was so long ago. You'll recognize him so quickly. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, he's I love Rock and Glasses. Oops. He's so funny. Mm -hmm. I love him. He's one of my faves. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Pullman. <laughs> oh. Yeah, so there's a gap. Yeah. So it's 93, 95, 97. He's a rapper? Mm, he looks like a vocal. He's a main rapper, like sub vocal. Mm. That's the other rapper. Mm hmm. Tag. That's the other rapper. Mm. 82? I don't know the reason behind that. Oh, good. I'll find it. Good enough. Man, you're just asking for dislikes, aren't you? <laughs> I'm so sorry. I'm trying to be realistic. Okay. I don't want to lie. I feel like you'll like, regardless of if you become a full goldenist, or if you just are like, yeah, they're good. I like him. <laughs> I think you'll like him. <laughs> tag, tag. Son Young Tech. Son Young Tech. Mm. Oh, Tech, like tag. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Tag. He's my Tonga. Hi, Chingu. Tag in Korean, they read it Tegu. Tegu. Mm. So skinny. Kiki is. Mm. This is Kiki. Why does Kiki sound familiar? Is that where that like young band, the East Light, was from? Maybe. Is jersey number seven? Yeah. I, I don't know all the okay. reasons for their Sorry. jersey numbers. <laughs> like, oh, cute. Don't let his cuteness fool you. He is very questionable. Questionable? Yeah. What does that mean? He's name. the pocket one. Also, Chingu. Oh, they did him dirty with that hair. <laughs> That's like, do you know if you have a team or I do not like that hair. He's the one in Without You. I already showed her without you, where you were like, oh, I like his voice. Mm. Right. Okay, I like you. Huh? He's also the one I told you that we want to close to his height. Oh, yeah. 
Joined Bulim late, I saw, and used to be JYP. Mm, you kind of got that personality. 98. Oh, gee, I wonder why. Oh, he's cute! They Let's be friends. Pocket boy. He's also 98, I think. No, oh, 99. 99. Oh, but he would be like grouped in with a 98 yeah. because of his early birthday. Is that Hatsune Girl? Oh, so he's a vocalist? Yeah. Mm. Mm? And they call- Yeah, he speaks English. Not like super well, but he speaks English. Yeah, they call him one of like, the- All the members are always like, he's the best looking ever. He's got the like model vibe. T-Bomb. Mm. T-Bomb, for some reason, looks like someone, and I don't know if it's a mix of people, or what. But every time I look at him, I'm like, why do you look familiar to me, right? I don't see it. I don't know. He doesn't look cold. Oh, he looks colder. Yeah, I know. He always he usually looks like that. Cool. T-Bomb is also the one. Oh my god, wait. They covered the Jonas Brothers? Okay, I like them. <laughs> and it's got weird standards. Um, I chose my MCT bias because he likes High School Musical. Sorry. Um... They, uh, I think, they make all make fun of each other, but they all collectively Do make fun of him. him. Like, T-Bomb is the one I think they make fun of the most collectively. <laughs> Wait, what? Oh! Oh, oh. Okay. He's, the, he's a vocalist, but he's the main dancer. I don't know why they didn't say that. He's the main dancer. He's so cute. Maybe they'll include a layer. Since he has multiple positions. He's like, when I watched Dandari originally, before I got back into him because of Coleman, mm. he was actually the one, of, one of the ones that I like remembered because he was the cutest moment in Dandari where he's like, oh! <laughs> it's like, oh, you're so cute. It's like a cute fairy. I wonder why it's 80. We can look it up if you want. I'll look it up later. I like this pants. <laughs> I want them. <laughs> They're definitely a few guys, right? Yeah, they look okay. Like I mean, he's wearing superstars. I'll be best friends. Is that superstars? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No. I need you superstars. Sorry, I'm completely unrelated. <laughs> completely unrelated. We are an Adidas family in this house. Oh yeah, it's Adidas. You can see the. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They're like trying to cover it up with tape a little bit. Horta yeah. Huey. Is that a reality for them? I think so. He's the other main vocalist. Jutan. Jutan. There's a lot of 99 liners. Oh wait, they didn't include- oh no, they didn't include Yeah, there's a lot of 99. The 99 line is a strong one. Even just in case that in general. I am. You too. I already ate two. Oh. <laughs> he does a really good cover of um, Charlie Wait, so then is he the one that sounds like Wuhan? I don't think he sounds like Cleon. I think he just has vibe. more of like that clean, like you know how sometimes he's more like husky. Mm -hmm. He's like a little cleaner. Mm. Yeah, the shoulder mm. Yeah, they do their albums. It, like Willem does their albums very similar to how they do Infinite's mm -hmm. albums, where they have like the, each main vocalist gets a solo song, and then they kind of these like little mini like duets, trios, mm -hmm. and then like a couple of group songs. Infinite H. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's very similar, except they don't have set sub units, so they like. So kind of like how Seventeen does. Yeah. Um, mix and match. Yeah, members. yeah, yeah. Mm. <gasps> oh, the Yankee! Table man. So young. He's so young. Oh, he's so cute! Oh my god, wait. Can Bung Shinky love in the eyes? Did I just reveal how old I am with that? We already know how old you are with oh, your K pop. Oh! He appeared- oh yeah, there he is. I thought they were just gonna show his chest. <laughs> I always forget Lovelies is also from Willow. Oh no. Yuji, you are yeah. my opa. <laughs> <laughs> he's there- he's very much like Sinjin. He's the resident girl group dance mm. aficionado as the mangne. Yeah. Except I think they intended for him to be like a cuter mangne. Mm. And then he got like super popular for the drama he was in. Mm. Oh, this is the previous number. But so Pomin got like super popular for the drama that he was in, and now is like everyone thinks he's really handsome and good looking. And I think they're kind of just like, uh, what do I do? I love dance music, but mm -hmm. I'm kind of into it.
That's cute. Was this earlier on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, it, it looks like it. They also, I think when they did you, Wold purposely tried to separate them concept wise from Infinite. Mm -hmm. But now Infinite's all in Bingo. Or like just got out, like some just got out. Military. And um, their most two recent songs yeah, are much yeah. different than like Hamdari, Tini, Let Me. I should probably be more conscious of what I look like eating. Ah, oh, that's cute. I think it's just a collection of their stages. Okay, there. Wait, no, 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 you can't. Okay, we're gonna be done with this video now because we're gonna watch those later. I don't want them to be like. Wait, skip through. I'll close my eyes and see if there's anything else. Generally, I would really appreciate this, but I'm gonna make Anna watch all of these. Oh my gosh, I should make you watch their. Um... No, that's it. Let's see the music videos first. Yeah, but I also need to make you watch their boy group oh my god you'll die they did this boy group mask oh, okay we'll do that later bye, bye. <laughs>